morning YouTube. It's a new day, a new video. It's uh, Thursday, the 4th or the 5th of February, and we're here to do a fence today. I'll just show you the fencing that we're doing. As you can see, it's in need of a replace. It's gonna have a new gate there, and we're gonna go all the way to the Ivor. And uh, we'll show you throughout the day. I ain't got the tripod today, so I'm gonna try and do it on my, with my hands. But uh, we'll show you the day, and then we'll go from there. As you can see, Blake is literally just touching that fence panel, and it's coming down <laughs> ASAP. So uh, it was definitely ready for a new one. I think this one's screwed on or nailed onto the wall. So we'll get that out, and then we're replacing it with concrete. It's obviously knackered, that's ready. Got all the panels and the concrete here, ready to go. Let's make it look good. Don't you love it when you can just pull the post out? Our hole's already dug. <laughs> now, I don't know who put this fence in last time. Yeah, but uh, I think you're supposed to use concrete because there's no way I should walk up to this post and be able to do that. <laughs> so, so whoever put this in, post fix next time. <laughs> right, so we're gonna get ready for our first post gravel board and panel. And as you can see, they've put these white stones on before and they've just laid them on the blocks. But thankfully, the blocks, oh, well they do eventually just fall out. So we'll be able to get a nice level bed and make that work to our advantage. So we've got two holes dug now. Plenty deep enough, over two foot down. Uh, that's gonna be a corner, obviously, because we're doing an L-shaped return. But it's just getting the tape. That one's a six foot gap, and then another one, and then the gate. I'll show you some more when we've actually got the first bay in. Right, so we're gonna drop that in and then we'll know to see how deep our hole is. We're gonna put a gravel board and a panel up against it. Maybe backfill out if we have to, to get it level. And then once we've got our gravel board and our panel, we know that that post is gonna to have to slightly go up. And uh, go from there. Gravel board in the post, sitting lovely and flush. Sitting lovely and level. First bay up and ready. Obviously we're gonna backfill all round anyway. But look at that, looking smart. Right, so we're ready for the corner now here. And rather than plant planting the uh, corner in the hole and then it not being the right height and then struggling like hell to get it back out, just get your tape measure. Measure down. See the number, it says eight foot there, look. So I know that post has got to go slightly up. So when I drop it in, it's a slight little incline up, or I can just chuck some stuff down there, some post creep, and get it to the right height. Rather than chucking it in and struggling to get it out, just measure and cut the first time. So it's a little bit later. We've got that bay up now. The customer has asked for that bay to be facing the other way so they can't climb in over the rails. And I totally get that. We've put a four before post in there ready for the gate so that hole is quite big you can see that uh, we've not left no concrete in and it's just looking like this from the other side looking lovely and smart and uh, we'll show you a bit more when we've done this side because we're going to put that bay in there and then get the measurement for the gate we've gone with seven foots and a seven foot here just so that I don't like doing it where you've got panel panel tiny panel Tiny panel, big panel. We're gonna try and make it look nice and flush for the customer. So it's the next day now. And as you can see, the fencing is all up. That's a six foot bay, seven foot and seven foot. We went with this option, option. This option, because we didn't wanna do six and then a little bit. We don't think it looks as good. And I think this looks a lot better. We've gave the post 24 hours to set. 
put a few extra screws in for support for the gates to hang, which my dad's doing just now. Had the gate made, custom. And then we'll get the hinges on and get this gate hanging. And we'll show you what it looks like at the end. Another job done. All completed. This is the outside, just in case you're wondering. So that's another job finished now. Hope you liked the little video that we've put together. I think it turned out quite well in the end. Obviously it was desperately ready. The fencing was falling apart like you saw. Uh, thank you for sticking around. Like, comment, subscribe if you liked it. And we'll see you in the next one. Cheers.